this fellow in Texas, uh, Salvador Ramos, um, he legally bought his two guns. And, right. and, and, and now, of course, now we didn't have the paper trail and the record to your point, but do you think that that would require maybe stiffer background checks? You know, no, no matter what you do, people fall through the cracks. You, you can't identify all these problems. You, you can't arrest somebody for a crime they haven't committed yet. Senator Ron Johnson from Wisconsin is an excellent example of a politician who doesn't believe what he says or provide proof of his claims because he doesn't have to. A couple of buzzwords for his base with a little bit of fury for his Fuhrer goes a long way to maintaining support and the status quo. You'll see what I mean a little bit later, but first, here he was saying that you can't arrest someone for a crime they haven't committed yet. A weird way to tell everybody that he hasn't seen Minority Report. Anyways, is this him saying that common sense gun laws won't prevent gun crime from occurring? Moving on. Uh, these are difficult issues, but again, the solution lies in stronger families, more supportive communities, I would argue renewed faith. We've, we've lost that. We, we, we stopped teaching values in so many of our schools. Now, now we're teaching wokeness. We're, t we're indoctrinating our children with things like CRT, telling you know, some children they're not equal to others and they're the cause of other people's problems. But these shootings, uh, they're, 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 Senator, there's were a going sickness. on long before CRT oh, I, and wokeness, right? I, well, yeah, I, think, I think CRT's been going on under the radar for quite some time as well. Wokeness has been. Liberal indoctrination has been. Uh, this is a much larger issue you then uh, then what a simple new gun law is gonna it's not gonna solve it it's not gonna solve it see when legal scholars Derek Bell Kimberly Crenshaw and Richard Delgado among others created critical race theory as a framework for legal analysis in the late 1970s and early 80s Ron Johnson was around the age of 25 and if CRT was indeed a thing flying under the radar for quote quite some time Ron Johnson didn't notice or acknowledge it while graduating from the University of Minnesota or while raising his three kids who are adults now. I mean, Ron Johnson only had 42 years to present one excerpt, a paragraph, a stanza from any book written about the basic tenets of CRT that says white kids are oppressors and black kids are oppressed. But again, he doesn't have to. When he claims that we don't teach values anymore, he's talking about teachers, you know, the people he can't entrust with curriculum, but will gladly equip with guns. And if K through 12 students have to enter school buildings featuring guards armed with rifles, one way in, one way out, breaking fire code, while learning from school staff who are also armed, Ron Johnson won't deem it to be conservative indoctrination and he won't notice or acknowledge that the values teachers are teaching kids is active shooter drills. For Rebel HQ, I'm Jeff Wiggins. My architect knows Japanese. For more from the Young Turks, stay right here. If you want to see content from yours truly, click on the hashtag below. I can also be found on all socials at he gonna be all right. Thanks for watching.